fashion retailer new to the Fifth Avenue Mall is not only promising to make you look trendy like your favorite celebrity, they're also giving their customers the opportunity to give back to the community. And Fox 4's Whitney L.B. Miller is here tonight to explain how one store is helping put an end to human trafficking. Whitney? Mike, the new boutique claims to be trendy, stylish, and affordable in this January in honor of Human Trafficking Awareness Month. Apricot Lane says it's supporting the cause through the sale of a special brand created just to fight human trafficking around the world. It's sported by some of the country's most famous. Take a look. Hi, welcome to Apricot Lane. Apricot Lane, the newest addition to the Fifth Avenue Mall and the city. The local owner says she's excited to bring the latest celeb trends right here to Anchorage. Some other brand names like Costa Blanca and Mila, some things that some people may not have heard of, um, but that's the reason why we brought them up here, because nobody wants to have the same stuff in every store. She says since they've opened, there's been an overwhelming response. A lot of people just kind of passing by going, oh, this new store, and oh my gosh, a new store in Anchorage. So yeah, it's been, it's been amazing. The store opened early November and promises to deliver fashion must-haves at affordable prices. We call it celebrity-inspired fashion, so we take a lot of trends that are in the, in the tabloids, you know, that the celebrities are wearing. And what they're wearing on their wrists. This month, Apricot Lane is matching all profits made from the sale of its Three Strands Global Bracelet and donating those proceeds to Agape International Mission, an organization helping to rescue and restore victims of human trafficking in Cambodia. Such an amazing opportunity to help these kids that really can't help themselves. And it's, it's, it gets, we get emotional, you know, when we talk about it, because it's such a huge thing. And Each handmade bracelet features a red seed from a Cambodian sandalwood tree. Inside each woven gift box is a thank you. So it gives you a little touch of personalization. And, and not to mention the bracelets appear trendy. Something that anybody can wear. We, they wanted to find something that could appeal to anyone, uh, men, women, it, with smaller sizes, larger sizes. Um, it's just something that's kind of more universal. She hopes bracelet sales bring awareness to a global issue that she says affects even us here at home. Now, the new store also offers a variety of outreach items for purchase, all proceeds benefiting different causes here in Alaska and abroad. Mike? Very nice. Thank you, Whitney. That's Whitney L.B. Miller reporting for us tonight. Summarize.